So one way to make a user feel like they're making progression is to have multiple levels. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna have basically a door at the end of my level over here. When big guy touches the door, we're going to send him to level two. So to do that, we need to have a, uh, a level two. So uh, I clicked on this little icon up here, which is the project manager. And you can see there's a scenes here. Uh, I've got untitled scene as my current scene. I am going to rename it because that is not a great name. I'm going to call it um, level one. All right, done. Um, now, what I'm going to do to um, duplicate everything that I've got already in terms of events and also the objects I've currently got in my scene is I'm just going to duplicate this whole scene. So level one, two, let's rename that so it uh, matches what I want it to be. Level two, done. Now, I'm also at this stage here going to make sure that my level one, oops, level one, is my start scene, set as start scene. So level one, set as start scene, it will always automatically go to level one. Now, which one have we got open here? Level one, I want level two, so let's go to level two. And you see I get an event sheet with level two and it, it's duplicated all of those events. But level two is not the level that I want. I am going to select everything. Actually, what I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll leave some stuff in there, but I'll leave, I'll uh, get rid of enough that I can tell that I've arrived at a new level. Uh, I'll put that down there and that over there. It'll be, it should be reasonably clear what's going on. Right, back to level one and I need a door. So add a new object and the object is going to be a, pretty sure there's a door in here. There we go, door. Add that to the scene. And waiting a second, close, drag the door into the scene. There you go. And level one events, making sure I'm keeping track of which event sheet I'm in. Add a new event. Condition is big guy. Again, collision with, always doing collisions in, um, in games. Collision with door. Okay, and in the action, this is under other actions. This is to do with scene and change the scene, and we're going to go to level two. Auto completed for us, and I think that should work. Let's just try it out, shall we? Always worth being sure of these things. There is a, an issue that we've got two very close event sheets now. So um, it's a good idea to only do this once you've actually got a reasonable amount of polish into your uh, game already, so you don't end up doing too much stuff twice. Okay, so there's my door, boom. And here I am, this is level two, we can tell because I deleted all this stuff over here.